Well, I'm Gil Fronsdahl, and I'm here at the Insight Retreat Center on May 24th. It's almost two months now since we started our renovation work. Tremendous amount of work uh, has been done already, including uh, demolition, reframing, electrical, plumbing. Uh, it's quite exciting. Uh, one of the things that stands out already is the shape and the feeling for our meditation hall and the bedrooms we're going to have. Uh, we have single bedrooms for everyone who's going to be on retreat. We have a, a wonderful meditation hall that already feels quite uh, peaceful. And uh, we have a great location for a retreat center. So I'll take you inside and you can see a little bit of what's been done so far. Here we are in the meditation hall. Uh, it's still being framed and we're putting in electrical wires. And uh, we have quite a large hall for 40, some 44 people, 45 people can be meditating here. And uh, we have over here, uh, the back wall is going to be where the altar is going to be. And, uh, and there's going to be a door in the far end going to the outside. And two doors indoors to a shoe area and uh, the inner hallway. This will be a place where there's going to be a lot of, uh, a lot of practice over the years. Looking forward to teaching here and to practicing here. So here we are on the deck that uh, goes all the way around the first floor. Half the bedrooms downstairs on the first floor will have an outdoor door to the deck and also an indoor door to the inner hallway and to the inside the building. So here we have uh, one, of the, uh, one of the doors and if you come in with me you'll see that it goes into one of the bedrooms that's in the process of being framed. We come inside. It's a relatively small room, but uh, certainly big enough for a single uh, person on retreat. Uh, there'll be a bed and a small table. And, uh, this bedroom here will share a bathroom with the bedroom next to it. Down on the first floor here, every two bedrooms uh, shares uh, two bedrooms share a single bathroom together. One of the teacher rooms where we'll have interviews and uh, a little office for teachers. It's in the process of being uh, constructed now. You get a small sense of what it's like. It comes directly off the great room, the big entry room that we have, which um, will make a very nice meeting room and walking meditation hall and um, general gathering hall. It has a very high ceiling. So here I am standing on the back deck. Uh, behind the back deck is uh, our little woods that we have, quite beautiful. Uh, the back deck uh, is right behind the dining room, so we'll have tables out here. Where people can come and eat uh, during the retreat when it, the weather is good. Um, uh, we're now already imagining being able to do retreats here. It already feels like a very promising place. And our aim is to have our first retreats here in November, if all the remodeling goes on schedule. Uh, the only uh, thing that might at this point uh, really delay the beginning of retreats is that uh, we still uh, uh, don't have the money for uh, most of the furniture that we have to buy. Uh, we might have to do either sparsely uh, furnished retreats or wait. Uh, we need uh, mattresses and tables, chairs, kitchen equipment, a variety of different things uh, to get it all set up. Um, but soon enough we'll have a retreat center. And I hope those of you who are listening and watching this uh, will be interested in coming on retreats with us. I look forward to welcoming you here on an uh, Insight Meditation Retreat at the Insight Retreat Center. Thank you.